when I was originally gonna make a video to tackle Mount Moon in this new version of a Pokemon game called as <clears throat> Poke1, while I was battling this seemingly strong Onyx and Geodude with my Crocona, I realized that there are a lot of good Pokemons down here and this particular Rhydon caught my eye. So this video is gonna teach you how to trade. Basically you just go on the user's name, press the right click button and click on message and you ask them how much they're selling their Pokemon for. The reason they're do the reason we're gonna do this is because we don't wanna give them extra money and we even ask the shopkeeper how much they're selling their goods for. He tells you a price. Now you can either agree on it, don't do that, or you can suggest a counter price which is like a reduced price or you can even go for a higher price if you think the pokemon is that worth it but honestly i wouldn't do that like in like a minute you'd understand why you know the hint was that entry right there but you lower the price and you wait if both the parties agree now i have i am talking to this hiker willy over here no pun intended hiker willy has an onyx but it will not let me trade. The reason for that is that you cannot trade while you're interacting with someone or battling someone. And Hiker Hill, uh, Hiker Willy was talking to me. Hiker Willy. <laughs> Hiker Willy was talking to me, so I couldn't trade. So basically, the trader puts his Pokemon in. You put the right price in. You press accept. It becomes green. If you still accept it, you get the Pokemon money gets deducted or you give the pokemon you get the money and if you want for good reasons you can even say thank you and stuff like that so here is quickly me trading uh not trading my pokemon's buying basically and ente and a snorlax now basically i've used the basically word thrice now but uh, entes are pretty expensive i did overpay for the snorlax like a lot but I guess it's a fire level so yeah